so in this example we are going to calculate the running time for this small algorithm so this is nothing but the for getting whether the user is eligible for voting or not so in the first line user will input his age so it will execute one time and uh, in the second line if the age is greater than or or equal to 18 so this will also execute for one time and if this condition will true so control will go on this line and this is also executed one time and the process will break so the total running time in that case is what three so suppose and if the user is less than or any other case like so this will execute one time let me change the color okay so this will execute one time and this will also execute for checking whether this condition is true or not so this is also execute plus one time and if this is not true so control will go on the else part so basically in the else part we will not including this so just control go on this print statement so this is also execute in one time so to the total running time in that case is also what three so it is so it is it is necessary the all the times every algorithm has the same number of same total running time whether it is conditional mismatch or not yeah so running time is what three if this process will go on for n user suppose so this program will execute like this and the total man so this will be what n plus three